Welcome back to EA Sports, continuing coverage of the National Hockey League, and we've got a good one tonight. An interconference showdown, east side, west side. I'm James, he's Ray. Setters glide into position for the opening draw. The Penguins start with possession as we are now underway. Cuts to the paint. Great reach with the poke check. And the puck's booted away. Forces the turnover in the defensive zone. The Golden Knights move to the offensive zone. The Penguins have it from their own end. Race for the puck here. Icing waved off on the play. Off target. So frustrating. You do all this work, you get it into a good spot, and you don't get it on the net. Big hit along the boards. He uses the boards in perfect form here. He closes off the gap and runs them in. Puck exits the zone. Picked up along the wall by Stone. Pittsburgh's got control of it now from their own end. Oh, and that doesn't go well. The Golden Knights gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. The Penguins played along the boards. Jostled off the puck. Moves it to Malkin. Pittsburgh's going to play it from the corner. Scores! Is that, is that 50 now in the year? Yeah, good math there, James. I thought when you got your shoes off the count that we were in trouble, but you got it right. Always nitpicking my math. Not bad year, though. You can almost see his eyes get big here when he gets a little step on the defender. Now he's going to drive it right to the net. Nobody can stop him, and for good measure, he finishes it off. He's hard to stop when he uses his big rig superstar ability to drive the puck to the net and put it on goal, guys. That's a power move right there. Quick pass to Marino. Pittsburgh's on the attack. Vegas has it near the wall. The Golden Knights take possession here in the open ice. Gets it over to Zucker. Pittsburgh's got it in their own zone. Great poke by Kapanen. Moves it quickly over to Yanmark. And that's not the side with the stick by Kapanen. Pittsburgh's got a hold of the puck now. Can't connect on the pass. His reflexes on display tonight. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Denies him on the play. The Golden Knights have it now. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the wall. Takes it into the slot. Battling for it along the boards. Pittsburgh's gained possession. The Golden Knights gain control of the puck. And now it's over to Howden. And a good heads-up defensive play in the open ice. Long jam in front, that's broken up. The Penguins gain possession along the wall. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Puck grab by White Cloud. Moves it on over to Tuck. And that's broken up. Pittsburgh's got possession of the puck. Rust's got it along the boards. Vegas has the puck. Poked away and forces the turnover at center. Stays with it. Here's a short pass to Howden. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. The Golden Knights take possession in the defensive end. Great use of the stick here at center ice. Quick feed to McGinn. They go on the attack through center. Pittsburgh's got the puck against the half wall. Scrum along the boards. Take it along the wall by Haig. Ross got it now deep inside his own end. Puck scooped up by Dumoulin. Moves it to Ruido. Pittsburgh's got it into the offensive zone. Back to the blue line. Blocked in front. And a quick little stick lift and comes up with the turnover. Quick pass to Dumoulin. And that's stopped by Leonard. Slides the puck across to Coglin. 
60 seconds left in this one. Musa quickly over to Carrier. Receives the pass. Here's a shot. Club save. I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain. Stone's good at transitioning the play with his joint zone ability. That's when he steals the puck to get on the attack. Latang's a steady defender who's known to join the rush. Those are two players I know I'm going to be keeping an eye on tonight. Let's see if one of them can give their team the upper hand. Guys, back to you. And with that, the first period comes to an end. Both teams will have a chance to get a breather, and they'll be back on the ice with period number two in not too long. Period number two seems ready to go. The teams are set. My broadcast partner, Ray Ferrar, was also set. Let's do this. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. Well, we've got over 20 minutes played thus far. Ray, how have you seen things? Vegas has to look at the way this game's been played so far and realize they've got way more to give. They're not going to get back in this game playing like this. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Stopped by the goaltender. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. I don't know if there's any time for an undisciplined penalty that could be a good one. With a one-goal lead is definitely not it. The first penalty kill of the game for this group here, and we know their penalty kills rank toward the bottom of the league, but this group's got a lot of confidence, a lot of energy. They just might be able to shut down this power play unit. The Penguins have it now. Vegas gains a hold of it. Looking for space inside the D zone. Sends a pass over. And that doesn't exactly go tape to tape. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Rust. That's off a stick. The Penguins have possession shorthanded. Down the right side and into the zone. Drives it to the crease. Oh, and another save. Great stop by the goaltender again. Back to back saves. Crosby side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. The Golden Knights get a hold of the puck in their own end. Passes over to Dodanov. The Golden Knights carry it along the wall. Pittsburgh's got the puck. Tries to the crease. Scores! There it is! Number 40 on the year! Great season he's had, and to bang in your 40th goal of the year is a great sense of accomplishment. This makes the coaches look smart every time. They depend on him for offense, and he delivers James time and time again. Pittsburgh's now made their way back to center ice for the faceoff. I see a lot of movement, a lot of talking on the bench right now. What's the message, Ray? Coaches are going up and down the bench, telling the players to stay on it. Don't back up. Puck sent over to Dumoulin. And that pass can't connect. Love save made by the Smith. Yeah, he's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. Vegas looks to get things going now with the puck. Across the line and on the attack. Let's it fly. Comes up with the stop. Slides the puck to Dumoulin. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. That pass doesn't go. Across the line from center. Centering pass. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Here's a short pass to Marcheseau. Big time stop. He's going to go back to the bench and want to look at that one again. He had enough time to really make a good shot. I don't think he quite got it where he wanted to. Latang's up and ready to join the play. Sends the pass over. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Dumoulin. The Golden Knights certainly didn't get the result they wanted on that power play, giving up a shorthanded marker. Well, they're not going to think too much about that. You, will, you want to at least generate a little momentum on your power play. Not only did they not score, they gave up a shorty, which is always deflating. 
Carter's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Pushes it across to Kapanen. Pittsburgh's got the puck against the boards. The Golden Knights will play it from the defensive zone. Oh, textbook poke check to turn that over. Sucker's got it against the boards. Nice pass. Great reach with the stick by Matheson. Takes the pass. From the left side, they gain the zone. Here's the shot. Oh, what a stop. Picked up along the boards by Matheson. Centering pass. And now it's grabbed by Janmark. Dished on over to Matheson. Passed up ahead. Pass it up ahead. Play develops. It's a two on one. Leonard's on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Still lots of time left here in this frame. The Penguins are currently sitting in the driver's seat leading 2-0. Crosby's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. James, he's only... Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. Sends the pass down low. Let's see what the officials are calling. Pacioretty's going off to the box for two minutes. Krosky's getting some ice time with this power play, and it's his zone ability that could be a difference maker in terms of generating offense here, guys. I'm going to be watching for that. Crosby's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Takes a shot. Oh, there's a great stop by Leonard. He was totally locked in on that play. Totally confident pulling that puck to his backhand. He actually switches to it because he knows he can deliver that puck on goal. And they send it down the ice. The Penguins scoop it up along the boards. Takes the feed from the left side. The Penguins play it along the wing. Knocked around, but keeps it going. Puts the puck on net. Can't get it to go. The Golden Knights move it in. The Penguins gain possession in their own end. Gains the zone through center. Crosby sliding the puck behind the net. Oh, what a save in front. Scooped up along the wall by Rust. Hammers one at the net. Oh, great save by Leonard. Really good save. Control the rebound. Get it into the corner where you can reestablish yourself. And he moves it up to Malkin. The Golden Knights will kill off a few extra seconds now. Can't find his man. Can't get it to go. Was moving the puck through his own zone. Here's a chance. Back to the net. They score. I like the way they use that manpower advantage to their advantage. They move the puck quickly. The penalty killers just couldn't catch up. Really effective power play there. They move the puck around, and they're able to find him right in the middle of the slot. Pittsburgh's widened the gap yet again tonight, Ray. How far can you widen the gap? Because they keep adding on to it. It seems like shift by shift. Poked away at center by Carter. We got a penalty coming up here on the play. And now he angles it across to Yanmar. And with the delayed penalty called, they get the extra attack around here on the ice. Penalty coming up here. Well, this isn't going to go down as one of his favorite periods he's ever played. That's a couple of penalties in this frame. Guys, we know this PK unit is ranked toward the bottom of the league, but what they displayed so far tonight, killing off that first penalty, hopefully they can capitalize on some more of that opportunity here. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Skates to the crease, and that banks off a stick. Hangs onto the puck. Looking to break out here on the power play. 
And that's poked away by Dumoulin. Hot clears the zone, and they'll be forced to regroup. Pass right in front, and misses on the tip. You kick yourself in the tail, Wacky. You miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. Through center along the wing. Broken up by Latang. Manages to hang on. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Boulder. The Golden Knights gain possession. Snaps one on net. Oh, what a stick save. Poked away in the neutral zone. Loose puck battle along the boards. Takes the feed from the left side. And no luck on that pass attempt. Moves inside! Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. The Penguins don't like it, but they'll serve two in the penalty box. Vegas is set to go back to work on the power play. Power play jumps onto the ice here, and they'll remember the shorthanded goal they gave up to kind of remind themselves just to make sure everybody's in the right spot. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps them at bay. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Here's a rip. Flashes the leather. The Smiths had to do his part. He's had a good night in the goal, but at the other end, they've been really sharp around the net. Hope everyone's enjoying the game here tonight. Another big face-off here on this power play. Pittsburgh's got possession here in their own end. Nice play, shorthanded as they get control of the puck. Quick feed to Carlson. Stopped by the goaltender. Right from the most dangerous area on the ice, the goalie flashes the glove. That's an arrogant stop. Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. And the goaltender gets to the bench. They've got the extra attacker out. There's the whistle. Let's get the call from the officials. Really hard to win when your penalty killers are on the ice more than anybody else. That's another penalty for them. The Golden Knights roll out their man advantage unit, and they've got lots of time with this five on three. These five on threes of this length don't come around very often here. What a great opportunity for them. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Moves it to Marcheseau. Here they come, three of them. Stopped by the goaltender. Scores! The power play delivers big time. Puck moves quickly, the players move quickly. That's a terrific goal taking advantage of the extra man. Vegas gets one back late here in the second. First time in a long while their bench has had any emotion. They've been kind of sitting there like they're watching a movie as they trailed by three. What movie? A bad one. And they get break away. Breaks it up with a puck check. That is as frustrating as anything. You don't even really get a shot as the goalie out thinks you. Puck picked up by Dodanov. The Golden Knights take it along the wall. Quick snap. Oh, denies them with the paddle save. Now, by being in the right position, James, he gets so tight to the shooter, there's nowhere for the puck to go. Can they capitalize on this power play? Here comes the faceoff. Pittsburgh's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Trying to clear. And a nice job by the Killers on that one. Yeah, now they can get a change, get some fresh players on the ice. A chance with the 3 on one Oh, what a save by DeSmith. Quick pass to Dumoulin. Tried to make a move and the puck hops away. Harder you try, sometimes the worse it gets. Maybe just make the simple play and you'll probably advance things a little better. The Golden Knights take possession of the neutral zone. Tuck's got it across the line. Takes a shot. Oh, what a great save by DeSmith. Pittsburgh's penalty killers get a hold of it. Passes the puck over to Dumoulin. Great defensive play at center by Tuck. Vegas was talking about working hard tonight and how they wanted that to go shift by shift by shift. Man, they've been in the right position a lot. Grabbed along the board by Lafferty. Takes the feed. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Sometimes you're in close, there's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. Big time blocker stopped by DeSmith. Oh, he gets a 
pays him and with the club. Gonna have to work a lot harder to beat him tonight, I guess. There's two excellent saves in a row. Oh, how did he keep that one out? What a save. He scores! Add that power play goal to the earlier one. They've really done well with the extra man here. The Golden Knights are back to center ice, and they have narrowed that gap. Cut the lead in half. The comeback's on. Now they must push forward, see if they can get the equalizer. Works it across to Zucker. And things starting to ramp up a little bit now on the ice with that play. Pittsburgh's got it along the wall. Here's a chance! Denies him! He got all of it! Leonard's gonna smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. Getting into the later stages of this period, Vegas is still trailing by one as they step in for the draw. The Golden Knights win it in the defensive zone. Slides the puck over to Pacioretty. And he sends it across to Stone. Moves it to Pacioretty. Puck moved over to Stone. And that's picked off. And with that, two periods now in the books. Been a great night of hockey here on EA Sports, and we got the third period coming at you in moments. James Sabolski, Ray Ferraro, ready to bring you all the action. Period number three is set to get underway. The Golden Knights win the faceoff. Slides it across to Stone. And just a good old-fashioned solid body check on the play. Denies it in front. Takes it to the net. Oh, what a stop on the play. Gets all of it with the paddle. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Slides the puck over. Into the corner. Moves it quickly over to Gensel. Puts it on net. And there's a great save by Leonard. Handles the puck. And now he moves it to Dumoulin. What a save! He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Dumoulin's play style can be described as a car crash. He's in one every 15 feet. Lots of time left in this period. Pittsburgh's hanging on to this 3-2 lead. Vegas takes possession off the draw. The Golden Knights move the puck in the defensive zone. A little banging and crashing now. How did he stop that one? He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. Takes a shot. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Here's a short pass to Smith. And that's knocked away in the defensive end by Pedersen. And a great save. In front. Oh, and it's another save on the play. Fires away. He gets that one too. Pittsburgh's got it in their own zone. And now he tries to get it across to Latang. The Golden Knights go to work on offense. Let's it go from the slot. Stopped by the goaltender. Costs it up in the neutral zone. Tries to get it to White Cloud. Moves the puck. With possession along the wall. Great heads up play with the stick by Latang. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Picked up along the wall by White Cloud. Takes the feed. Great forecheck by Kapanen. Receives the pass. Along the half wall with the puck. Fails to find the open man. This is the most fun time of a hockey game. When every play is so important, the game is tight, everything is on the line, and your decisions and execution is what's going to make the difference. Past the midway mark in this period, 3-2 is where we sit in what has been a tightly contested affair. Sends a pass over. 
Moves with the puck at the corner. Slides it diagonally to Dodanov. Textbook poke check by Pedersen. Gaining steam here on the attack. Simple stop by DeSmith. Quick feed to Aston Reese. Sends the pass over. With the blast! Scores! They came, they saw, they took advantage of the rebound and scored! Uh, goalie burps up this rebound here. It comes right back into the shooting area and the rebound is put away. The Penguins have now given themselves some breathing room in this third period. They've ground the game down now, James, where they're really in control with that second goal lead. Taken by Coughlin. And a smart heads-up play to poke that away by Matheson. Pittsburgh's got it across the line. Takes a shot. Turned aside with the glove by Leonard. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Who had the edge? Carlin's standing by with the answer. Latang's got my vote in this game, guys. Neither player we talked about earlier has been able to get on the board, but despite that, I think he's been engaged and worked hard out there. Oh, and that's off the blocker. What a stop by Leonard. The goalies are so good. Sometimes the way to beat them is with a little unpredictability. That's the backhand. Nobody really knows where that puck's going when it leaves your stick. And makes the save. Ruido's got the puck in his own zone. And that's stolen by Pacioretty. The Golden Knights have continually put themselves in good positions defensively tonight. It seems like every shift they're stealing a puck. Oh, that's a big time save. I think he got it with a toe. Takes a hit, but still hangs on to the puck. Crosby's got it in the offensive zone. Cuts to the front. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Centering pass! And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Martinez. Keeps hold of the puck. Routine save made by Leonard. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. Latang's got great skating skills, even when he's moving backwards, guys. That's his in-reverse zone ability, and that's how he faces forward so effortlessly, even when he's backing up. On the attack along the boards. Latang's gonna play it from the back of the cage. He scores! I believe a colleague of ours likes to call those back-to-back. -back. Yeah, the coaches want you to stay aggressive after you score. They do that, and they're able to put another one up on the board. He's tight to the net, he doesn't have much time, and that snapshot beats the goaltender from the low slot. The Penguins have been enjoying Pad the stat night here. It's been going all night long here, even in the third. They came to play tonight, they have not let their opponent breathe, and it has been a dominating performance. And that's picked off. Moves it to Rust. Nice zone entry from the middle. Rust's gonna play it against the half wall. Huge steal in his own end. Smith's moving it ahead. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. And that's poked away. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by the Smith. Aaron pass, and they can't connect. Final horn sounds, and we are all done with this one. Pittsburgh's offense really seemed to push the pace there tonight, Ray. From your, uh, from your vantage point down at ice level, what'd you see? Well, they never spent any time in their zone. They'd go back for it, quickly out of their zone, then up the ice. They had the puck, it seemed, way more than half the game. And there's a salute to the fans after another victory here in the house. Yeah, look at the way the energy percolates through the building. You got the music going, the fans are saluting the players and vice versa. It's a cool vibe. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us tonight.